in high level design round we are evaluating the candidate skill on designing a large system the end result should be an architecture diagram of the overall system and sequence diagrams explaining the important use cases in order to prepare for such an interview read about how other systems like amazon google youtube twitter whatsapp etc works all these major companies have written a lot of white papers blogs and other articles explaining parts of their system try to imagine how they all fit together for example there's a white paper from whatsapp just detailing end to end security another thing to remember is the shortage of time in just 30 to 40 minutes you have to explain a complete complex system so being bit clear about what you're talking about is essential use generic terms as much as possible and rely on specific technologies as less since this is an amazon interview the interviews are probably familiar with popular aws products so that might be another way to speed up the conversation one major mistake i see candidates make is forgetting about availability storing everything in memory in a single host is not recommended for most use cases but in an audio video call it's possible that losing a stretch of audio is better than playing it delayed what's more important would be continuity of the conversation but often it's desirable not to lose data when you're talking about persistence think about what kind of storage systems you would like to rely on for example databases or persistent queues even within a database explain the type of database like rdbms nosql graphdb etc that you would like to use and how it would be appropriate for the scale being designed down and the type of operations you want to perform when talking about queues explain what kind of features it need to have in both cases it's essential you know the details of how things work i often hear candidates asking about some esoteric features from these databases and they need to work at scale if you claim such a feature is required i usually ask them to design that part in detail so at least have a cursory understanding of how they work another common mistake with candidates is not understanding basic network stack like how internet works this help if you are designing an asynchronous task or a bidirectional communication system if you are going to rely on something like say lead election it would be better if you know how it works but at the very least be aware of its limitations review the requirements and ensure all parts are covered in the architecture to ensure completeness make sure auxiliary systems are covered as well like data bi analytics monitoring alerts pagers billing reports etc and all the best for your interview